Three, two, one. We here at Ville Pickle Food Trail yeah. Adventure. Got the big helper, big homie over here. Yeah. You heard? We got the shrimp strip, spicy pot flavor. Now, I don't know. What do you think about spicy pot? Judging by the last one that we did, um, I, I'm not too. I'm not very happy for this. This is gonna be brutal. It's gonna be brutal. And like I said, just opening this, you, I don't even know how they close this. Cause opening it, I mean, look at this, bro, man. Ah! Everything you got. The back of the package. Yeah, the back of the package has a guy who looks like an egg. It looks like he's smoking something. Egg man from something. And then there's a little guy dancing around. All language, you can't understand it. I'm sure it's extremely unhealthy. There's a lot of preservatives in egg this. Eggman from Sonic. Yeah, it's the Eggman from Sonic, but he's got a beard and he's smoking something. It just doesn't. Oh, is he these, I don't know that these are going to be hot. Oh. I mean, look at that. Look at the inside. Look at that. I got my milk already. Yep, he's locked down with the milk. I'm going to go ahead and hit it. I don't it. know if this looks bad. Is it spicy? No, it ain't spicy, but it's unpleasant. Definitely shrimpy. <laughs> Definitely got that shrimp taste to it. That mm. shrimp straight out the bottom of a bait bucket. Leave that. Oh, no. Do you like it? This number's fine. I mean, okay, not, not okay. Fair. Yeah, this one got a little uh, weirdness to it. Here's an example of the chip. No, no, sir. It's a weird little stick, but it's a little firmer than a cheese doodle. You really gotta wait for the kick. And it comes 15 seconds <laughs> after. It's got kick, but it's also got a weird bottom of the bait bucket taste. Mm -hmm. Which, if that's what you're into, I mean, look at that. You know it's gonna taste like bait bucket when the shrimp's already red, like it's been sitting in the sun all damn day. It smells. Sorry, it's rice like shrimp. Ooh. Do you smell that? That's that bait. Boy, that's some shrimp right there. I wouldn't call that two-step fire. I'd call that two-step bait bucket. Still cracker. You need to try some of these. Get that Taiwan on. I tell you this, it does have a spicy pot flavor. Now, I don't know what pot that is. It might be in the bathroom. I'm not really sure. But this chip definitely ain't for the faint of heart. This is for the real chip eaters. Oh, that last one is still on me. Oh, it's got it going. No, like the last chip. But if you'd like to smuggle some chips back, this probably ain't the one. It ain't the baddest out of Taiwan. I don't like it. I'm hitting it at five. I don't like it. What are we hitting it at five? Yeah. Shit, this bit is 3.6. It's, 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 ugh. I don't even know how to make that flavor. I mean, I do. I leave shrimp out you know in the what? sun. Actually, I'm giving that a four. Four? We're I going down to four? Good. Don't do an amateur score. Do a four point something. 4.2. Dave Pornier, what? Four Portnoy? Portnoy at Barstool, he always goes, you gotta go with that middle number. So 4.2. 4.2 4. 4. 4. 2 out of my man here. And he's an athlete. He plays them sports. I'm gonna hit it with the old. Mm. Hoop and Kings merch. Yup, get that right. Baseball life, yeah. Hitting that baseball life. Yeah. But yeah, I'm gonna say uh, 3.8. 3.8. If you're starving to death, probably not bad. Otherwise, just uh, leave some shrimp out and uh, drizzle it on some chips and probably have a similar effect. Maybe take a real hot pot, whatever the hell that is, spicy pot, and just I'll, deal with that. I definitely want to use my money on that. No. I ain't going to no. buy that. Hopefully these are like 10 cents in Taiwan because otherwise this shit's worth maybe 5 cents in the U.S. But uh, not my thing. Not my thing at all. Bill Pickle, Food Trail Adventure. Got a little homie with me. Peace. You heard?